Welcome to another episode of Ozfish. Davey, let's get some. I'm out for a uh, quick afternoon session this afternoon, fishing in a part of the river that I normally never ever fish. And unbelievably, it's only 10 minutes from where I live. So I have really been neglecting this part of the river. So you'll see a lot of people, you know, fishing uh, these sections of the river, just like tackle fishing. You know, jewfish and, you know, brim, bass, EP, flathead, that type of thing, this time of the year. And uh, yeah, I really have neglected it. So I usually uh, do another things and fishing lower on the river, live bait and snapper fishing, doing all those sort of things like that. But um, I thought I'd come out for a crack this afternoon and put some work uh, into this part of the river. So I need to come out here and fish really re regularly. And uh, yeah, utilize my sounder, um, just come out here and sort of like work it out. <clears throat> the good thing for me is that like, um, my father was a professional fisherman, like a prawn fisherman. And uh, when I left school, when I was really young, I, I was lucky enough to, to work with my father on his prawn boat. And I'd been on dad's prawn boat, me and my sister, since we were little tiny kids. And we would fish this part of the river all the way here and up the river um, all the time. So I know this river system really well. Um, I know where all the deep holes are and all the rock walls and all the flats. Now it's just really a matter of coming out and light tackle fishing and um, see if I can have some fun and uh, catch some fish. So yeah, this afternoon I'm just going to fish up till dark. Just going to use multiple techniques, some paddle tails, uh, some plastics, uh, some jackal transams, a samaki vibe. Um, even got a little hard body lure. Maybe uh, I can see if I can catch a brim off the rock walls or maybe an EP or a bass. Anyway, mix it up a bit. But um, yeah, I was really lucky. I met a, a really nice girl at the boat ramp. Um, oh, she introduced herself, but I can't remember her name. It could be Amy. Sorry if that's your wrong name, but um, I have seen her on YouTube fishing. And yeah, she's really cool. Like she's out there and uh, she's into it, man. And uh, she gave me a halt prawn. I've never used a halt prawn before. And I've got it set up on a really ultralight tackle, like a G Loomis 842, really light rod and small reel and uh, yeah I gave I swapped her a couple of laws so thanks for that that was awesome so I'm gonna have a bit of a flick it's got the electric down see if I can catch a few fish let's get on it there's a fish First fish for the day. Oh, Brimbo's come up and swiped at that vibe. Sort of caught him in the bottom fin there. Yeah, little Brimbo. Aggressive fish, you know, got him on a Samaki vibe, like a 14 gram vibe, but uh, yeah. Apex predators in the river too, the old Brim. They're animals. See you, mate. Fish. Nice big winner brim on the vibe. Here you go, man. Smash that vibe, eh? And that Samaki vibe, 14 gram, UV mullet, really good colour on the river. So that brim, yeah, he was deep. 
like 25 foot of water, you know, really solid fish, it's uh, probably about a 36, anyway, let's get him back. Yeah, so far, uh, I've caught two brim and they've both been on the uh, 14 grand vibe. All right, baby. Fish. Smaller fish, but yeah, the vibe's working really good on the brim today. Yeah, another smaller brim. Close to legal, but. All right. Yeah, the Samaki vibe, you know, like, uh, really is an amazing lure. Like, I'm fishing a rock wall. It's fairly deep, like, about 22 foot deep. And I'm just throwing into the edge of the rock wall. Not too close, because I've got uh, six points on those two trebles there, so. But the brim are picking it up. fish right on the edge of the rock wall where we go he's down deep Gonna believe it. Wow. Tell you what, you don't see that every day. Yeah, blackfish on the uh, Samaki vibe. Wow. Got him right in the mouth too. He wanted it, so yeah, solid. <laughs> Unbelievable, mate. Cheeky. Very cheeky smashing that vibe. Nice fish. Let's get him back. That's three brim and a, uh, a blackfish. All right. There's another fish. Yeah, man, another brim. You can see how that, uh, <clears throat> that medium-sized Samaki Vibalicious on those deep water winter brim, it's actually, uh, you know, working really, really, really well. So yeah, awesome, UV mullet, man. What we got? Another solid brim. Man, the Samaki vibe's on fire today, mate, on these winter brim. Unbelievable. Oh, come on, stick your tail out, bro. Yeah, another nice brim, man. I think that's five brim for the session so <clears throat> it's been a bit of a revelation for me today using that medium sized vibe down deep on these rock walls it's uh pretty good i'm hoping to catch a jew i haven't got a jew yet but got some brim in that so what i've had all the success on today on this quick session this afternoon is the 14 gram samaki vibe and uh i think this is a like a uv mullet color 
but it's been very effective for me this afternoon, particularly in that deeper water uh, when I've been uh, fishing for brim. So I'll be catching brim in, in around that 23 to up to about 30 feet mark. So yeah, it's, it's, it's been really good. So give them a crack in the winter. Don't be afraid to, to get them down for them brim in that deep water. It's been really good. But, um, the area I'm fishing, it's pretty rubbly on the bottom here and I've hooked it up a fair few times. And uh, but I've managed to actually uh, get it back, but I'm just going to uh, quickly re rig it because I've frayed my line down here. But yeah, Samaki Bibalicious, great lure on big winter bream in the deep. Well, I'm going to wrap it up before I lose the light. That was a fun little session. I uh, just went out for a quick afternoon session and just fished in a part of the river that I've actually never um, lure fished before and pretty close to where I live. So um, yeah, it's fun. Ended up, uh, I was trying to catch a, uh, some small dew in that, but I didn't catch a dew. But um, I ended up catching some uh, really nice brim uh, on the uh, Samaki 14 gram vibe down deep. So that was kind of really cool. And um, surprisingly, I got one big blackfish, one big Ludrick uh, on the soft five as well. So anyway, the uh, soft five rule supreme today, the UV mullet. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that really short episode. Until next time, this is Dave signing off. And always remember, well, let's get some.